Good afternoon to all of you and welcome to the official fifth debate in our 2012 NDP leadership race. I found it interesting. I found it largely, again, um, that I'd like to see more distinction made between the candidates on some points, and I think there could be more distinction made. That we have flexible federalism. I, in terms of, of the answers that people gave to the questions, it was very hard to say that anyone was really much better or really much worse. I mean, everybody was, was in many ways on the same page, which has made this, this campaign very difficult. There's too many candidates. It's, of course, I mean, it's hard when you have seven candidates. Everybody has to give their own opinion and you have to allow for discussion. I'm not really sure how to remedy that uh, beyond um, the candidates just showing the, the progressive and and social democratic side of their own platform uh, without attacking the others because I don't think that's helpful. And at the end of the day, you know, what, what I was really looking at was uh, how well they, uh, they were able to uh, express themselves in French. There's a heck of a lot more that unites us than anything that could divide us. Yes, it would have been better to have less, but it's nice to see, uh, to see different ideas too. And it's hard to find a, a party where you can have seven candidates for leader, bilingual, comfortable, and able to speak to francophones and anglophones. This is what will unite and build a stronger Canada. It's very hard. Um, we want to wait until the last minute just to give everybody the chance to, you know, to impress us. Um, I think at the end of the day, it's going to have to come down to who's going to be the person who's actually going to be able to defeat the Conservatives in the next election. I think that's the main, main goal.